Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Paul, Mike Zero, Whiskey November Uniform, or 26 Charlie Tango 730 if you catch me on 11 meters and PMR 446. So, I connected the spiral loop antenna up to the FT991A last night, uh, it, after doing some tweaks to it earlier in the day. So, it's currently propped up against that wall now, it's still there, and I think it's still connected to the radio actually. So, I had a go with Whisper by getting the SWR tuned on that frequency to, well, it was almost nothing according to the 991A. Uh, as at 5 watts, because that's the lowest power output that radio can do, because uh, Whisper is supposed to be quite low power. So, it's worked out quite well with me being heard 3,032 kilometers away by EA8BFK, who I believe is located on the island of Fuerteventura in the Canaries, which ain't too bad. Uh, that one here, YO3GNE, I believe they're in Romania, at 2,279 kilometres away. All of these are like mode 2, and this is the amount of spots that got from these stations. So, the top two spotted me twice, a few of these spotted me twice, a couple of them only spotted me once. So, and all of these are mode 2, because that's what I was using. So let's have a look at that on a map, shall we? So here's the map. The map is a bit funny on WhisperNet at the moment. I think they've got some issues. This will also show stations that I heard as well, because I was uploading uploading spots. So that one... So these ones that all heard me. There's quite a few Gs that heard me, I think. So, if we look at me, that tells me I'm, uh, all, all the stations that, that I heard and all the stations that heard me, which isn't too bad. So, you can see on the map where all the stations are located. Some in the Scandinavian countries here. The one there in Poland. I think that one I heard. Oh no. It was both ways. That's excellent. You've got the two in Romania. This one this one I heard. But this one heard me. Which is interesting. Um I think there's two Italian stations close together there. Uh, let's not scroll in. Some, some in France. Yeah. Mostly European countries. In fact, it's all European countries where I've been heard. Including right down here. That's my furthest away. So that's actually pretty good if they heard me on that loop. So yeah, let's zoom this map back out a bit. So, yeah, that's pretty much everything that heard me and I heard. There's a few I heard as well then uploaded because I had that turned on. So, I'm not going to go into a full detail on how to actually do Whisper because I think uh, the guy behind WSJTX, uh, Joe Taylor, can't remember his call sign. I do know it ends in JT, and I know he's American, so it's a K. I think it's K1JT, but do correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> I should know, because I use the software. <laughs> uh, you know, doesn't come to mind straight away, but yeah, that's the piece of software I would use, I've been using for Whisper, because the only thing I've got that would transmit Whisper at the moment is, in fact, a computer and... Uh, an FT991A. I don't have anything else that would do it. And I don't have any antennas for any other bands anyway, so I can't really experiment. So, that shows the antenna is working in the house, surprisingly enough. So, yeah, it's in the corner of my radio room right now, and I'm, I'm actually impressed by that. So, I'm looking forward to actually making some proper contacts on it, and I want to test it with more power through it, but I'll do that slowly once I've uh, evaluated everything else and also 
worked out how much power that capacitor can tolerate before it flashes over, which I'm hoping it will do the full 100 watts out of the radio. <laughs> that would be nice, but I uh, don't necessarily need that 100 watts because, as Whisper proves, you only need as much power as necessary to make the contact. Now, 5 watts has done this for me, so 5 watts is perfectly adequate. Now, obviously with the antenna in here, it's probably going to pick up noise. So, Whisper's a good good thing to have a go at, so if you've never had a go at it, why not? <laughs> I just thought, yeah, I'll have a go at this. Now I've got something that might do it, and this is, this is my first actual proper attempt, and it worked. This was after I got off work last night. It was about, although I, I had something to eat first, and then I thought, let's go in the radio room and give this a try. So... Paul, Mike Zero, Whiskey November Uniform, or 26 Charlie Tango 730 if you catch me on 11 metres, and PMR446, or just a red squirrel on CB and PMR446 if you like, because like I said, there's nothing stopping you calling me that on PMR446 as well. <laughs> so, 73 for now, and I'll catch you in the next video, and hopefully... There's a video I've still got to finish off. I'll hopefully get that finished. But obviously with S Storm uh, Dudley and Storm Eunice being about, I've not been able to finish it off. And other storms as well. And other high wind situations. Because that needs an antenna outside for that one. So, I'll catch you in the next video. Hopefully it'll be that one. But it depends on the weather. Seven threes for now, guys. <laughs>